Hello, everybody, and welcome or welcome back to Star Renegade, which is the second game in the Five Days of Fury, which is a sponsored event here on this channel, sponsored by the publisher of Star Renegades, Raw Fury. We're checking out a new game from their catalog every weekday this week. I got to choose the five games. This is another one that I think you guys will be excited to see, either because you wanted to see more of it from the past or you've never seen it before. This is an incredibly cool roguelike JRPG with a very fun timeline-based combat system, lots of, like, neat interactions with relationships, stuff like that. I've just, I've been wanting to, to jump back into it for some time. It's gotten a massive amount of updates since I have last played, and it's been a while since I've last played, but in we shall go. There was just an update on the 16th, in fact, that added, like, a new character, new bosses, and entirely, like, an entirely new ending. But, alas, yeah, we, so we played before, and we, uh, we one, I think, with these characters, so that's saying that we can't use them again. I could have could have sworn I remember the name Zerks Nurza because, boy, that's such a fun name. Uh, so, who shall we pick here? Raven Tisano. I mean, that's pretty cool. Health Regenerating Damage Soaker that can dish out elemental damage with the power of his mind. I mean, that is pretty cool. Pox Machiner. I love it. Uh, or Davian, Davian Syphix. Feels very appropriate to go ahead and bring Davian in. How many? We get to pick three? Okay, so we'll get Davian, we'll get Raven, and then Hell. Let's see here. Tark, Tark Chanlo, or Pox Machiner. Let's go with Pox Machiner. Choose a hero perk. Gain two affection when receiving cards in camping. So it looks like we only have a couple different perks right now. These are things you can unlock with meta progression, so you can have them start off with different things. But for now, we'll just get those things, and you can pick between two. Gain increased damage and crit damage. So either better at making friends or better at making corpses. Let's go with better at making corpses for the fun of it. Pox Machina is not here to make friends. Easy, normal, harsh. We're going to go ahead and go with normal since, like I said, I, I haven't played for like a year. I uh, But I've, I've had such positive memories of this game. I, I really, really do. I'm excited to get back into it here as part of the Five Days of Fury, which again, sponsored event, basically is just, I want to tell you that there is a sale going on. They're, they're celebrating all of their games, Raw Fury. Go click the link at the top of the description and go see what's on sale. Maybe pick something up. That's that's basically it. Win, answer me. Let me know if you're alive. Don't look so promising. Oh, okay. Well, I'm fine, Dav. Those enemy fighters are good. Really good. I'm lucky I managed to land in one piece. You get points for missing all those buildings. Wait a second. When? I'm getting a signal. Something big coming right near... Bop. Did you get big murdered? Right away? I just can't wait to get out there and start indiscriminately murdering people. I'm just really jazzed about it. So this is kind of like, uh, if you're familiar with the Shadow of Mordor style nemesis system, that's the kind of thing we can get going on here. Like if we uh, if we have issues with fighting certain enemies, like they will eventually rank up, stuff like that. We're working our way up to the big bad here. So for now, Tylen Morland, we can get a, a, a brief idea about what this character will do. I, you know, enraged when hit with a combo attack, you know, sure. I'll worry about that when uh, the time comes, but for now, I think we will just exit out here. I don't think I'm gonna. I don't think I'm gonna change any strategy here today. We're probably not gonna be able to get a full run in today because they're. It's like a little bit more campaign-like, like a very condensed, almost darkest dungeon style, style vibe. But here we are in our overworld. We uh, okay. Let's see here. Where do we want to head to? There's a fight over here. Whoop. Against a Menku drone, there is, I believe, a food dispenser. It contains food cards. I think that's a way to replenish HP during camping, I believe. For now, though. Let's just pop on out. Look at our crew. Look at our lovely crew. In the combat, we shall go where I am going to be incredibly rusty. Do we have a way to put somebody in the back line? Okay, so here's the, okay, let's go over the, the very brief basics that I do remember, and that's the timeline system up here. So basically, 
This is 60 seconds of time right here from 0 to 60. Uh, if you tack before somebody, you see, we will get a crit. And a crit will push them back. Uh, well, I think it might depend on the ability, but you see right there what it'll do. On the bottom in the middle, it's like a little flashing thing. It says crit bonus. If you hit them before their attack, so if you do a faster attack than they do, they will get pushed back in this instance. 20 seconds, they will have their armor shattered, and they will take an additional 14 damage. So, it's a lot about juggling uh, who is going to be hitting earlier than others, that kind of a thing. So it looks like we could potentially get lucky and uh, could go for this. Extra 21 damage, we get an armor shatter, but I don't think they have any armor, so I don't know if I care. Anywho. Alright, so, blade throw. We've got to learn what these characters do. 40 damage twice, and I can't remember what that does. Does that mean it's a... I think it means it's a ranged move. Holy moly. Let's do that. What do you got? Vorpal Strike. It's a very slow move. So, yeah, you're going to be attacking my guy, which means that would crit them, because you're attacking first. Could defend, cannot be delayed, could do all that. Vorpal Swarm, what's that? Free action does not end the turn. Converts the Guardian Spirit into a flurry of attacks. Gain one Spirit next turn. Gain Spirit on hit. Does extra damage for... Sure. You know, we'll process that in the future. But for now, I think let's do a little bit of a pushback. Shield Steel... You're planning on doing Shield Steel. Which just means you're going to... Okay, you're going to do 17 damage and steal some shield. That's kind of fine. You're going to go for a Direct Strike. I want to get that guy killed first. So, we'll do Take That. Push the Son of a Gun back a little bit. We're also looking to push them off the board entirely. That would be a really good way of going about this. Okay, so we've actually pushed them back far enough that we can handle that. So, sure, we'll go for Blade Throw, and then we'll do Vorpal Strike. Alrighty, bang. So we got them opened up. We're going to take... Ooh! Alright, double hit there. We're going to take this Shield Steal, which... I'm just kind of okay with. Because shield will come back. I'm not really too worried about it. Alright, so yeah, going for shield steel again. We have Vorpal Swarm now. Free action does not end turn. Spirit into a fury of attacks. Okay. So that's just like an extra little thing they have instead of shields, it seems like. So that's kind of neat. So it's extra damage versus cursed units. Let me Vorpal Swarm. Crit bonus, it does an extra three. I mean, should we do that? Probably not. I think a Vorpal Strike would probably be the way to go. So I think we do the same thing. We start with you, which is a, a quick attack that does a lot of pushback. Let's Siphon Stab. An AoE of five. that does some pushback and gives everybody in the party some shield. That's pretty cool. It's irrelevant for us, but you know what? Whatever. Let's do Vorpal Swarm. It's a free It's a free move. It did 10, 10 shield damage. Push back. Good. Double strike here, which I think goes through the shield. Yeah. Oh, God. We, we lucked out. Okay. Never mind. Didn't even have to worry about it. Let's go. All right. So we've moved down here. We have a finite amount of moves we can do each day, if I remember correctly. That actually might only be when the boss shows up, but alas. There's one down. Get some DNA. All right. Who do we want to level up? Gain Stronghold. Protects all allies from damage this round. Gains Reflection Shield. I don't know. Reaction. Reflects damage with a cooldown of one. That seems great.
but protects all allies from damage this round. How is this possible? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get that and I'll see what's going on with it. Level up. 27 health. New power. Okay. Good stuff. Check out the... Uh, oh, let's go to the squad page. I think that that's how we change the... No, we, go to, we change the formation at the formation page. I'll put you there for now. I don't know if you're necessarily... You're tankier. Wait. What the hell? You don't look like a tank. You don't have any shield, though. That's the big thing. You have 200 health, but you have zero shield. So all the damage, I think, is going to be a little bit more permanent. Which is a, 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 a hair more of a concern. So we have a fight down here. With the drone. And a fight over there with the drone. But what are we going to do next is the question. It looks like this gives us a little bit more paths as an option afterwards. So let's go with this one for now. But yeah, so if we're in the back line, we actually cannot be struck until we kill every or until they kill everybody in the, the front line, or if they have a ranged attack, obviously. Okay, so let's see what what does this take? This takes okay, so this takes twenty fury. Gotcha, gotcha. That's how it's balanced out. It takes twenty fury, which is a resource that will generate over time here. Okay. So what's what's she doing? You doing a direct strike on Pox? Doing a cannon blast and marking our back line. You are you are concerning. Can I knock you off the I don't think I'm knocking them off the entire timeline. I'm thinking I think I'm knocking them to the exact end. Oops. And I don't think we have another. I don't think I have another way to knock anybody back. Oh, Vorpal Strike does. There we go. So we'll do that. We'll break you. The concern here is that you're going to get crit. Aren't you? Nope. Nope, because you're going to do your action first. All right, we're all good there. So we blade throw. This thing is dead. We have a very aggressive seeming team. And also, obviously, this is the beginning of the run. This is supposed to be easy, you know? Like, just because everything looks so visually epic and wild that I'm like, oh, okay, so this is a scary fight, but the game just looks epic, which I never use that word. I hate using that word, but it's it's truth in this case. Cluster Bomb, that sure sounds like an AoE. It's not. It is. Oh, it hits them and the person behind them. That or it's an AoE. I can't... Oh, it is an AoE. It is hitting them in the back there. Okay. Well, the good news is we should be able to just push you off the entire map again without much of an issue. There's only so many times we can do that, but right now there's really no issue with this. God, what a, what a cool move. It's just... That's what it is. That's that's what makes the game have that epic kind of a feel. It's like the visual effects, the sound effects, all of it. So it all culminates so well together. God dang. Thank you, Raw Fury, for the, for the reason, the, the justification to get to come back. I just adore this game. Enhances your armor, contains DNA. I. What do you mean here? Let's pop down here. Which hero's armor would you like to improve? Is this from top to bottom? Fuck up his. He's definitely going to be up in the front line there. Okay, hold on. What are we missing? We, we got to go down here now to fight Tylen Morland, a firewolf, a sadistic firewolf. All right, is there anything we need to change? We don't have enough DNA to level up. 
Relationships. Nothing we need to worry about right now. All right. Yeah, let's go fight him. Let's do it. Let's go, chump. My violent urges have returned just in time. Well, hello there. Smelt. What's your plan? Okay. Burning, which is blocked by shields. We does 37 damage in an AoE and breaks armor. It says it breaks armor, but it's a... Oh, it only breaks armor if it goes through your shield. And since the backline character has no shield, obviously that's going to happen. So, okay. Step one. Stop if you heard this one before. I Here's the thing. Can we Vorpal strike you off the map? Okay, if we can Vorpal strike you off the map, I'm actually going to go ahead and... Carve... Carve to reduce your armor, because that it, it does like a flat reduction of damage. Okay, we're actually doing... Also, your weak versus flurry moves. All right, we haven't even gotten into the crazy combo systems and, or uh, used any fury moves or anything. That is wild. Look at that. Armor break down to zero. No, uh, no more damage reduction in any capacity. That knocks him off the map here, so he will be right here, which is... That's the thing, is you knock them into the next timeline. You knock them in the next Tuesday. Uh, is it going to turn down the audio just a hair here? But y y we will have to deal with that issue now is the big thing. So we could heal up with everybody. We don't have any kind of like crazy f other move here to worry about. We could just defend with literally everybody. This doesn't do any knockback. Let's try that out. Let's do a full uh, a full defend here. And we counterattacked. That was fun. Can't wait to do it again. So you should be cursed now. There won't be much left after I'm done with you. Hergerd von Stage 2 description. Got him. Bleeding 10. So you're vulnerable. Seems to be what I can gather here. Okay, you're screwed. You're screwed. We have we have an all-out attack we can do here. Vorpal Swarm. We can drop all of that. It does 28. Oh my god. Kill shot. Not even close, baby. Bye bye. Bye bye, Thailand Moorland. Camping card unlocked dynamic duo. So, this is a, well, we'll showcase this in a little bit here. Defeated adversary lieutenant together. Exhaust when used. Okay. I guess I deserve that. Boom. <laughs> I always remember that. Okay. Who are we, uh, yeah, who are we checking out next? What you got? What you got? Let's get some equipment. New gear. Plus 12% damage on AoE attacks. Nah. Uh, laser, 25% damage versus health. Versus specifically their health. 10% damage extra versus marked. Who is typically doing our second attack? It's honestly, you're typically doing our second attack. After they break the shield this is obviously a better item but you can see only he can equip it i think i'm gonna go for this insufficient level oh shoot also that's a level three thing okay i'll tell you what yeah we'll, we'll take it we'll stash it we'll level up gains heroic resolve free action 
25 shield. Okay, costs 25 fury. Everybody gets 25 shield and applies 25% damage up and immune to crits. I mean, sounds great. And then we can go ahead and get... Let's see here. Squad. Character. Gauntlet. I think there's a better way to do that. But there we go. 25% extra damage versus health. Typically, I think that character will be hitting second. So, sounds good to me, man. Great job. You slice and dice those bogeys. Now that their base belongs to you, you've earned a break. Set up camp, get some rest, and we'll push on to the mor <laughs> next morning. I have the same voice. All right, here we are. Camp. This is something, you know, we, we've seen a couple couple roguelikes do this, especially in the past year. It's, it's a, a system I really do enjoy. Um... Uh, Okay, so who's who's got what cards? Yeah, we have five available action points. Defeated adversaries together. Exhaust when used. So this costs zero and increases their their friendship by three here. Attacks cause bleeding. Armor piercing, fifteen percent. That costs two, one, three. Health reset to 100%. I don't care about that. Because we're fine, so... Oh, but it does give five love points as well. Okay, so it has to be played over there. Wow, is everyone, is everyone on this team so thoughtful? Oh, it goes so fast. All right, so they're now friends. Attacks cause bleeding. Armor piercing. Well, I mean, we should do this on you. Makes the most sense. Five love points. They're friends now. Heals health. Damage. Up by 15%. Generic agreeableness. So we have three. That gives five points. I'm going to do this because it gives us more love. Does that put us where? Never, uh, never mind. <laughs> it doesn't really put us up that far. All right, what else we got? Oh, hello. Before I joined the Imperium, I met and met Mother. I was a pretty and aimless person. The Imperium really brought a lot of joy and purpose in my life. Now I get to kill things. The Neo Coven. Alright. Hello there. More rioters. Disgusting. These interlopers remind me of myself before I met Mother. I too was sad, scared, and prone to outbursts of irrationality. Okay, so we have three. Okay, we'll do our dimension proud, won't we, boys? Three different bosses here. That's... Okay, so we could... F Arrival in three days. So we can't do that much before that happens. Credits. If we went up here... We'd have to go here. And we'd have to go here. Is that guy not a boss? That guy's not a boss. One, two, three. Or, or th wait. So it's three charges a day, I think. Let's go just, I'm gonna go fight this guy immediately. I'm a son of a gun, what can I say? Anti-Imperiumers are just a bunch of hooligans with nothing better to do in order to serve in Mother's... It's an honor to serve in Mother's fight against them. Well, hello there. Fire, laser blast, shield, steel. Okay. Fire, 38. Okay, it's a little... It's all, like, annoying, but also fine. 
So I think we do the same sort of a deal here in the sense that let's go ahead and take that this guy. Nobody's attacking the back line because then we can knock him off the map here. We can maybe get a big murder by then. He gets enraged when he's flurried. That is a concern. And yet. We'll knock him back. Shields are down. We get the extra damage versus him since he has no shields on. Now this is what's going to be a little stinky. But it's fine. We have our shields for a reason, man. Armor break. Break. Yikes. So we can't push him back anymore either. He's going to fire. He's firing on you. We have two people firing on him. Let's go ahead and either do heroic resolve. I don't think that we want to do that because we have no shields to heal. doing big damage there. Uh, we could try and go for a knockback on who? On you? Could we? Are you in the back line? Honestly, it does not look super promising. Okay, what does Carve do for us? It's, it's a good amount of damage, but it's pretty far back here. Why is he? He's getting shields back. Who's giving him shields? You're giving him shields, but that's that's so far. That's much further. So he's not actually going to have the shields there, will he? Am I crazy? Why would he have shields there? I think I'm missing something. Oh, I could do that. I actually kind of like that idea. And you do Stronghold. Protect all allies from damage this turn. Cost 20 of our fury that we've been building up over the course of all of this. Not worried about it. Okay, so yeah, he is re redistributing. Yeah, redistributing the shields, but this actually might do it anyways. Oh my god, you are so lucky, you little son of a goblin boy. But his move should be reset. This will shred them, I'm sure. Okay, so he's really far back, so I should be fine. This does 18 times two. That's a kill shot. God, that having that on a free action is really neat. Okay, so the plan here, you're doing bestow shields on self. I don't care. You're doing laser blast. I, I do care more. We should be able to get... Yeah, so there's a kill blow. And we want you to... You will... Okay, you are going to attack after the shield bestow. That's awesome. Whoop, whoop. Bye-bye. Yes, you done, you've done it. You've applied shields. Shield steel. I do not care at this point. We really ought to just uh, go for the big murder. Bye bye. Bye bye. I was just following orders. Boop. <laughs> I just, I don't know why I find that so funny. Am I, is there something wrong with me? Uh-oh. I was sure that fight was going to go our way. Uh, should I be worried? No, I will trust in mother. Okay, so we still do have three days. That's, that's right. 
Bland Heroism. Attacks drain shields. The two combats. Gain three elements. Free action does not end turn attack. Gain pyro, ni pyro nitro pulse damage. Interesting. Gains reflection shield. It also gain warple bond. When this unit gets hit, guardian guardian gains plus one spirit. That's just a passive that you can give it. The campsite. Let's go for it though. Let's go for it. All right, where? Okay, let's get our equipment. Okay, so you can wear this. Twelve shields per round, plus twenty shields, and reflect damage. I mean, you know, it's a, it's a fine idea because you can wear it, and it would give them shields when they don't have any. Seven armor, for fourteen shields. Let's get that and put it on. There you go. Now you got shields when you didn't have it before. This area is about to be locked down. We'd have to go one... Or wait, does it... I feel like it might be free, a free action to go back. I can't remember. I think that you might have to... It's free action to go here, but then it would it's not to do here, so we could go boop boop nah. Let's go this way. Breach! Alright, so we took damage just walking in here. Okay. Should've known. Smelt. I mean I definitely feel like we just do the obvious and just like go all in here. This carve is curious, though. Okay, because that'll happen first. This unfortunately does not go until after, but then we could do activate nitro. What are you weak against? Nothing? Bonus damage versus pyro. I guess maybe we do pyro? <laughs> Alright, sure. That gives us the break. We go for that. We are going to have to take a hit, I think, though, with the way we're doing this right now. The shred in now. We could spend maybe... No, we do not have 20 fury. It's okay. We can take a smelt. We can take one, one smelt. That's fine. We do have Vorpal Swarm we can do for free, which is something. Yeah, we don't have any quick attacks. Are you doing... It's an AoE? Oh, so you can't have shields. Interesting. You're attacking everybody. I don't really care if they take damage, though, because they have shields. So let's go ahead and just get a kill. It's annoying that the back line has to get hit, but it's also fine. Good stuff. We should be able to get attack in. Yeah. It's good enough for me. So long. So, okay, so we just got some credits. go one two epic equipment yeah we'll do that i'd like to fight the elites so we're gonna all right yeah we're, we're gonna have to take 15 damage sure 
Let's get you that level up so you're on par with us. Gave him the reflection ability. Wait. What's that about? What's that question mark about? Okay, plus pyro enabled, so we want to... Yeah. Alright, so we want to switch off pyro is basically the whole kit and the whole caboodle. Flex 25%. I mean, I think we just do the exact same thing. It's the same character. We'll take a little bit, and then apparently we will heal, though. So we do take that, we do blade throw, and then we do a little bit of a defense. We could do a stronghold, but I, I'm fine with this. Clearly, we get healed up a little bit. Otherwise, they wouldn't be at full health. Good stuff. Pretty gnarly team we got here. Are these mega shrooms that make you grow if you eat them? These shrooms are actually quite intelligent. I believe this one's an accountant. Not exactly high on their list of crimes. <laughs> Why? One of the Grevalian mega temples I've heard about with the hollow preachers? Well, sure looks abandoned now and uh, filled with giant mushrooms. Temple really inspires me to live the way the Titans tell us to in the Book of Titanium by practicing human sacrifice. All right. So we got a camp because it is now nighttime. Gotcha, gotcha. No valid target. Why? Because they need to at least be a companion. Shoot. Okay, we'll do a little bit of friendship that way. Don't tell any others, but what? I won't! Some general friendliness that way. And then we don't have enough resources to do those now. All right. I don't have anything. I didn't have anything to do with them, did I? Am I crazy? Uh-oh. Now I feel like I, uh, did a blind. Oh, well. All right. Hello. A different set of enemies than what we are familiar with. Some laser blasts. Literally everybody is attacking you. Oops. Oh, no! Okay, well, that's literally... I didn't think that that... Okay. That's not... All right. Okay. I meant that I wanted to switch to this character. I didn't think that... I didn't think we could do this on somebody else. I thought this was only... I was like, oh, for sure this is just on him. Whoops. I was literally meaning to switch to... Whatever. All right. That's on me. I mean, I can do it again, apparently. At this point, sure. At this point, I feel like I basically gotta. And we'll also hit defend there. This is, a, this is interesting conceptually. Yeah, let's do that. A little bit of move back. We can actually get a kill. So one less hit that we're going to take. They all got a little bit of bleed, too, which is nice. We reflect it back a little bit. Reflect back. That, that worked well. That worked very well. Take that. Blade throw should do it. And a vocal strike. We'll just the hell of it. Nice.
increíble. Let's gain some armor. I feel like if you're going to have no shields, I feel like you should have some armor. All right, do we go boss? Fully heals the party. It's irrelevant right now. Whoop! And yet, and yet I'm going to go. Got nothing, uh, no level ups to do here. I'm going to go up here because there's some epic equipment we uh, got to take a look at. I say, who'd like to make a wager on where these primates will travel to next? I say they're coming in my direction. Ah, yes, you've uh, very astute. Pyro enabled. Let's take a look. Don't do pulse. Pyro seems fine. Laser storm. Two attacks are being focused on you. see what that looks like for a second with in conjunction with this. Okay, so that's not lethal. What about carve? Is that necessarily... I could do that. Oh, for sure. What? It's not even a kill. Siphon stab? That doesn't feel... Well... Okay, hold on. Let's rethink this. If we siphon stab first. That lets us potentially carve. And then could we... Alright, this, this is fine. This is fine. It's not good. It's fine, though. We're still gonna be taking the laser storm hit, which is a problem, but... Yeah. See, I can kill things, too. We split up the damage, so we didn't even lose our shields here. My hypothesis is that this will go well. Okay. So a Siphon Stab would heal him up double, but I don't know if we need to worry about that right now. Because he's the one taking damage. So... I mean, he's going to take a lot of damage. Laser eyes. Okay, which one's doing the most here? I would think it'd be big boy. 76. Like, I could push him off the edge. Could we... Where are we at as far as, like, getting him killed? Not very possible. We could easily kill this one. Right? Like... Oh, my God. How much does this do? Okay, that actually does a lot. Let's do this right now. It'll just make a bigger difference. the fire and the bleed. I feel like that should be enough, shouldn't it? You're going really early. Ah! Could we do Vorpal Strike here? You know what? Let's do that. We'll break you off.
and hopefully he just switches targets. This will get a get us a guaranteed kill. All right. No, not quite. No, no, it, it was all accurate. All right, for some reason, I thought that the bleed or the burn wasn't being factored in. This is concerning. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, no, it did work. All right. I will bend you to my will. All right. Calm down, calm down. Let's really make sure... Okay, so there's nothing... Do I want to carve, or do I want to just... No, I, I'm ha I'm actually really happy with this. Because we're going to push you off the edge, but it's going to be... All right. All right. It's going to be really late in this, so it should push him back decently far. All right? Yeah. Okay. 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 So now we can work with this from here. We're at 19 Fury. I feel like if we Vorpal Swarm, this will generate Fury. It does not... This is more concerning then. Okay, you are being silly and you're attacking him, so sure. Why does it say we're taking so much more? Oh, because we're we're letting ourselves get crit. Do a little defending. And then we'll just do some damage. We, we should get a kill more or less, I think, here. See, I can kill things too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I learned all I've needed to. He's trying to retreat. No, sir. You will not leave today. Little swarm for the hell of it. Like, he could run and retreat, and he could come back in the future, like that kind of thing. That little punk. I had so much more to achieve. Poof. Poof. Mother will surely feast on your bonus as punishment for your poor showing, and of course, it would be justified. Wow. Okay, so we could go for... I... I mean, it upgrades the armor a bunch, which honestly is pretty decent. Health and shields up. Let's see. Penetrates armor 25%, inflicts burning 3. Weaken their defense. We already have those gauntlets on this, so never mind. So it's really just... What, what is it? Insufficient level. Well, but it's a level 3 thing. That, that's actually more feasible. We can get that probably right here. Bland Heroism! Complex scheme. What's that? Reflect damage. It's another option for camp. Cool. Uh, how do I? There's got to be a way to open up our inventory quicker, isn't there? Than going like this. Boop. That's an extreme amount of armor. Thank you. All right, so we have two days we have to get here. Let's go kill this other boss, right? Let's do it. We have a whole other day. I used to be a nobody, but now I'm in the ranks of the big bad Imperium. Not for long. Pyro enable, we definitely are gonna wanna swap that, right? You've gotta resist Pyro. Resist Pyro, resist crits. 
hates laser, enraged when hit with laser damage. So Nitro or Pulse should be totally fine. Well, that is a huge break. Carbon. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Enrages versus laser. Is this is a laser attack? I thought it was a flurry attack. Oh, it's a flurry and a laser. He's going to enrage, like, basically no matter what I do, anyways. So maybe we, uh, well, yeah, let's do that. This, this is a nitro attack. Push him off the edge. Do I want to push him off the edge right now? What's he planning on doing? He's planning on attacking. Carve him. Let's uh, let's leave it. Good stuff. Shields down. Armor down. Reflect a little bit. Blast them. We may begin with our free auto attack. I am but an ascension of Mother's Will! Yeah. Oh! Vorpal Swarm's not enough! Alright, um... I think we can do... Siphon Stab... Into a free attack from Vorpal. If this... Yeah, so that's a kill. And then we can work from here. We're definitely going to Vorpal Strike here. It's a little goofy, but hey. Do we want to push him off the edge? Doing another attack on him. He's already Is he already being pushed off the edge? Oh, he, that's not him. He's already off the edge. Okay. All right. We'll, we'll make sure he has zero on the down. I, I, that move pushed him off the edge. Or it's going to because this... Good. No, super, 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 super clean. Hopefully this pushes back far enough that we can get an attack in prior. Otherwise... Uh-oh. Uh, oh my god. So freaking lucky. So freaking lucky. Do we have our, we have our free attack? We got it. Maybe? Wait. Oh my god, This we couldn't have gotten any luckier on that. It, it's perfectly here, and then it's perfectly there. Oh my god, that couldn't have gotten any cleaner. That could not have gone any cleaner. Bye-bye. Bye, nerd. Bye, nerd, die, nerd. Uh, we got it. Cool. Another camping thing. I was just following orders. All right, now we have, like, the super mech that's going to, I think, jump down. All, okay, inflicts 10 seconds extra stagger on all attacks, 10% crit damage on all attacks. I surely do like the sound of that. More damage versus health. More I mean, it's, it's good. Crit damage, 10% crit damage, and 10% stagger. I mean, I, I always use him for that anyways, so I think it does make sense. So that's just lore things. It has to be done there. It costs zero, so we might, you know, we'll do it. Health reset. Yes, please. Beautiful. We have two free things. I think we got to go with the, uh, yeah, attacks cause bleed. All right. Good thing. Good thing. Good thing. They're getting a little, uh, little in love there almost. And by that, I mean, they're kind of acquaintance friends. They're coworkers at best. All right. So my question here is, does this take, a, this doesn't take a, uh, a charge, All right? Correct. 
fully heal the party. I don't care. I don't care about that path. Yeah, I'm trying to find a path that I actually care about here. We could go... Do we just leave? Do we... Do we just leave? Like, we'd be doing... Well, we could level up. Okay, so let's get back down here. Whoop! Uh-oh. I janked it. Ah, oh, I keep janking it. There we go. Go. We'll breach that. We got it. We might as well. We're going to get a little bit of experience out of it. And it should not be difficult. Alright. I mean, Siphon Stab sounds fun to just start with. Care about the shield steel, really. That's a kill shot. Vorpal, I can't. Maybe we. Can we kill with. You with Vorpal? We can't. Not really. We can break you and then do an instant free attack next turn. I kind of like that. Alright. Yeah, that's all like a little bit better. We should have at least examined the amount of damage that's coming down here, but. Oh, we definitely should have. It all worked out fine. That oh my god, that burn. Whoa, dude. That, okay, never mind. That all went incredible. Uh, take that into blade throw, which is already a kill. Into Vorpal. Yeah, this was just this was just a nothing, nothing fight. Nothing uh, to worry about at all. Some more DNA gives us. Okay, we can't go down there. Right there, this. Like I could go down there. Can't go down there. Let's just, uh, yeah, let's just leave. <laughs> All right. I don't need to don't worry too much. Where even are we? Go up here. Pop back. You're running. Oh, we can hold shift to run. Well, we really might as well. Does this... I thought there was a chance that would heal our armor. Okay, so we can't even go down there. I think we've really locked ourselves off. Let's go up here. I think we should fight Big Boy. I think that's what happens. Oops. I got stuck. I'm fine with that. Let's go with it. Let's go with it. Let's go with it. Camp. Okay, we're definitely doing that. Here I sit, the most evil scourge of the entire galaxy, staring at my greatest foe, a member of the Star Defenders. You may believe in law and justice, but you're no match for my powers of evil. It's true, but sooner or later, the Defenders will catch you. And then what? Lock me up in a null zone, throw me into a pit of sandworms where I'll be slowly digested. We have a plan, and that plan involves getting you into intensive therapy until you've worked through whatever issues are making you evil. Companions. Traits unlocked. Five shield steel on all attacks. 15% armor damage. Ooh. Attacks drain shields. Oh, on e that's on everybody, huh? Sure, I'll do it. We don't need to worry about the uh, about the healing cards because those are just irrelevant right now. Let's go. Big bad time, right? The behemoth has arrived. 
Citizen, you are approaching a highly volatile site that our organization is cleaning for your benefit. You are welcome. Okay. So, I know this is an awkward time to ask, but what is a Titan Court? Never mind, I guess it doesn't matter. Alright. Let's go, squad! All right, what's your what's your deal here? You you have no deal. Really? You're just scary? You have no there's nothing special there. Okay, you're doing a bursting shot which is uh, an absolutely extraordinary amount of damage that I'm going to now reflect. Yeah, we'll deal with that. I need to take that him. You're defending. That makes sense. Vorpal strike, I guess? We'll break him. No, I don't really... Wait, I don't want to break him. Oh, shoot. Oh, I beefed it. This is, this is strange. This is very strange. You have approached the restricted area and will now be submitted to potential extrajudicial, extrajudicial punishment such as, but not limited to, excruciating pain, dismemberment, and death. All right, so I wanted him to be kind of near... Yeah, that's much better. Okay, we can deal with that. So we can do Carve, which is incredible. Siphon Stab is tempting... What's happening? Why are we taking damage? Am I... Am I bleeding? Why am I taking damage from this? I take a lot more from this. Do you have some kind of reflecting thing on that you're just not telling me about? Alright. Whatever. So are we taking damage from this hit? Gaining shield there. Maybe it's just telling me I took the damage because I didn't push him off the edge yet. Okay, you're attacking everyone. Everyone's going to be taking a little bit. We could do a reflection. I feel like it's not the time. I think we just get to shuffle him back all the way there. That helps a lot. Siphon Stab is... Tempting. Is it an? It, are you telling me we get, we have a net perfect shield gain situation here? Is that what's actually happening? And then you d you are gonna take a hit. We can at least reduce your armor a shred. Okay. All right. But the armor being gone is very helpful. The sh or the shield being gone, we can really start to hopefully break down a lot more of that now. Armor break, not great. Burning, not great. Still alive, how presumptuous of you. That I am alive? How uh, presumptuous that I am factually alive right now? I'm trying to generate enough fury. Gaining armor? Why is he gaining armor? Wait. No, he's not. Okay. It looked like he was going in reverse there. 
I can't push him back with anybody but you. That that has continually been a problem we're, we're dealing with here. You're attacking him, which is a kill shot. Suboptimal, to say the least. Okay, do a little, little itty-bitty defend in there. You don't get any crits, though. Okay, this is huge. Armor has been not reduced whatsoever. The reflection is doing... Oh my god, the reflection is going to break his armor. Huge! So, I can't siphon his shields because he doesn't have any shields. So that's that. I think we just go for it. Give approach to the restricted area will now be submitted. Yeah. Am I wrong? Why does he have? So Why did it say he was gonna have zero shield? He most definitely does not have zero shield. That is factually inaccurate. I'm gonna do a little carving. A little bit of a blade throw. And we're going to break him, I guess. I don't know if it's going to push him far enough, though. I'm concerned. That might not be pushing him far enough. Okay, we can lose somebody as long as we don't lose everybody. Ooh. Okay. Well, I like... I actually actively enjoy that it's an AoE. That helps a lot. So it's not going to be a crit. Let's just do some defending. I actually kind of like that. Just doing a group defend for this moment. We're going to get more Vorpal Swarm. And then next turn, we're going to do like an all-out... Omega Blast. So live our perception. So you keep saying that. I don't think that means what you think it means. Wait. Reboot. Okay, it's a big heal. Uh, I don't think that's going to matter. Uh, Vorpal, we're going to go for it. Wait a minute. Okay, um, hold on. This is not going to go well. That's a problem. Is this going to be reflected too? I guess it was a specific type of attack got reflected. Uh, this is not great. Because, yeah, he gets healed there. Hope your journey... I actually... I totally beefed it there. Why did that attack get reflected? Uh, I guess it was just a specific element. Hope you enjoy your your journey to the Nether Realms. Nether Realms, just kidding. There's no afterlife death. <laughs> Final existence is meaningless. Thanks. Thanks. What are you doing here? You're, you're going for him? It actually could be a lot worse. I think we have it anyways, even though we totally just threw. Okay, okay, okay. This is actually... Stop. Got it. There we go. Uh, reflection shield on you. Late kill. Are we going to get reflection damage? What's happening? Late kill, are you saying like... Is he doing a move that does a lot of self damage or something? What's happening? Why why is this a late kill? Cuz you've approached the restricted area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It lied. It lied. Okay. The good news is we have to win. Like it like okay, even if 
even if we died here, we would have one extra turn to do stuff. So yeah, literally I just should have analyzed why we... Because <laughs> the other two characters, I, w I did their turns first. And it, there was no nothing about a dang damage reflect, so I didn't think about it. Mother, I have failed you. Bye-bye. Beautiful. All right, so now we are going to be done here today, but this is just a little bit of a showcase of what happens next. You go through like three, I think it's three zones. We can either recruit the empath or we can recruit the commando, for example. Uh, I'll, just, I'll recruit you. you gotta, straight up would have a party member uh, join. Just literally get four characters now to play around with, which is awesome. You can buy gadgets. You know, all of that jazz. We can buy different weapons before we go out to another uh, another kind of a zone. So, you know, you can piece it together here. We got all these individuals out and about. And then we have our final boss, son of a gun, up there as well. But alas, alas, that is that. And that is going to do it here for Star Renegades, our our journey back into it, our foray back into it. I really enjoyed this game. It was super fun to, to pop back into it since we uh, we did our big run of it when it came out, and it was a lot of fun, and I kind of wanted to do more, and hey, we've done more now. But a heads up, just a reminder, this has been a sponsored video, part of a five-part sponsored series called The Five Bays of Fury, which is celebrating Raw Sember, a, uh, a Raw Fury celebration they do every year. And basically, the sponsorship thing, just go look at that link right at the top of the description. Please check out the amazing catalog of games that Raw Fury has. You know that if you've checked out this channel for like any amount of time, you know that this, this rings true. Hopefully this is not falling on deaf ears that I actually do genuinely. Like when I see Raw Fury has published a game, I really do think of it as a like seal of approval that there's a really good chance that I'm going to love it. So... Genuinely, click the link at the top of the description. Go see what's on sale as part of the Raw Sember event. Pick up something nice if you haven't, uh, if you don't have a specific game that you know you've seen on the channel that looks really fun or just anything looks neat. Generally, like I, I don't think I've played a Raw Fury game that I haven't enjoyed so far. So I, I, I really do think it's been a great, great opportunity, and I, I very huge thanks to them. And make sure you go pick up Star Renegade specifically if you enjoyed watching this here today. You can find that at the link at the top of the description as well. Uh, it's just a really good time. It's got, it's just a really good time. Got a really fun, solid combat system to it. I really do enjoy it. That's gonna do it though. Check out my channel for indies and roguelikes every single day. And hey, let me know if you want to see more Star Renegades. Comment down below. Thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you for checking the channel for Rogues. More every single day. See you next time. Bye. <laughs>